All right, folks, you're about to hear a little bit of rumbling. Sorry about that. Today I'm going to show you how to do a hair file, a hair texture like we did before, except it's going to be much quicker and simpler. Start off, file new. Make sure your width and height are both 256 by 256, unless the hair you're deriving from specifies otherwise. Go straight to filters, render, clouds, difference clouds. Set your Y size down to as low as you can get it, which is 0 0.1. And your X size, I would suggest anywhere from 10 to 16. The lower the setting, the lower the number, the wider, oh, excuse me, the wider the lines, the larger the number, the thinner the lines. I'm going to go ahead and leave it at 16 and click OK. Now, instead of colorizing, because you know I don't like the colorize button, if you saw my previous video on hair, right click new layer and choose a gradient. Today I will be using the gold gradient and it is, there it is, and simply just put your gradient over it. You can do it up and down or left and right, it doesn't matter whichever way suits you best. I'm doing it up and down because the way the light parts of the gradient are, it looks like a shine. So, I'm going to go to Mode, Grain Merge, and there you have it. Self-Shined Golden Hair. Right click, Flatten Image, and save as a JPG, and it should be just fine. 